there are a lot of jets to choose from on DCS, and it's still growing. After playing Arma 3 for god knows how many years, I ended up finding DCS because I always found myself flying around and just, I've always been a fan of planes. So I jumped on DCS and for me, I started with the F-16 and kind of lost track of what jet I ended up buying next, not knowing that DCS offers a free trial period for 14 days to try out these planes. So yeah, if you're someone like me, you spent a lot of money. Anyway. Once I bought the F-16, I kind of got bored real fast, only because most, if not all, the PvP servers are just BVR, beyond visual range. Basically, you can only see your target on the radar, you can't actually see it to the naked eye, you lock on on your radar, you fire the missile, and you fly away, and hope it actually hits. That's it. And you're doing this non-stop. So obviously, I wanted to find something that had more close quarter action. I wanted to be able to see the target in front of me. And that's when I found Enigma's Cold War server. By the way, definitely want to check this one out. This server is doing very well. It's growing in popularity like nobody's business. Definitely check it out, especially if you want to try more of those old style jets. And that's the next step for me. Once I found the server, I just needed to find the right jet. And once again, I was paying way too much for a short period of time, but I think I finally found the right jet for me. The AJS-37 Vegan. A Swedish jet that was introduced in 1971 this jet has it all on DCS, whether it's air to ground, air to air, even recon on Enigma's Cold War server, where you go out just with chaff, flares, jammer, and your imaginary camera to take photos and reveal enemy targets. In this video, I'm showing my favorite loadout for the all-in-one fighter jet role. To start off, I always make sure I have air-to-air -air missiles on me for the obvious reasons. Then I put one to two gun pods for close quarter combat and maybe replace one of those gun pods with chaff and flare for countermeasures. But the biggest thing that's big about this all-in-one loadout is the RB-75. Technically an air-to-ground missile, it basically looks for a certain contrast, a dark target, and locks onto it. The best part about this missile is it's not affected by chaff or flare. So without further ado, enjoy. Rearming complete. Huh, guys got the same loadout I'm running. Oh, hi there. Um, yeah, I'm just going to pause this for a second. Uh, I forgot to mention that the first flight I did, I actually had bombs on me and uh, two sidewinders. Pretty much like the loadout you see my buddy next to me right here has. Uh, the reason being is I just wanted to test out the air-to-ground bombs. Uh, did not work out so well, but this section does have some air-to-air -air combat with some helicopters that I ran into. Okay, that's it. Bye. That's him right in front of me right here. Yeah, that's definitely him. Oh, it's so much different having bombs on. You are so heavy. I don't know where he went, but I'm gonna hope. Oh, there's a hind right here. Oh, if only I had gun pods. Oh, it's a hip. Fox 2. Nice, got him. Oh, another hip. I'm turn around. Oh, 
Hopefully I get to take him out before. Oh my god, there's a lot of helicopters here. Oh boy. Oh, what's happening? The lag is real. I don't know if I took out that guy. I hope I did. I should get back in the mountains. Yeah, call out a bogey dope here. Oh, we got a mirage. He's kind of right behind me, actually. Actually, wait, 175. He's like right behind. Might be flying away from me now, though. Which would be yeah, more ideal. Oh, there's some ground targets. Perfect. Those are our targets. Let's drop our uh, fuel tank. Let's go in for the kill. Oh boy, he's like right on me. on. I hope that worked. Let's look at the kill feed. Well, I definitely got something. No, I never mind. I didn't. I missed. I missed. Damn it. It's close, though. Let's call it bogey dope. 284. Yeah, he's right on my six. Yeah, there he is. See if that'll hit. Hopefully it doesn't hit the mountain. Come on, contact, contact, contact. Ah. Oh. He's in the sun. Good tactic, man. Let's go vertical. He's also going vertical. See if I can gain some speed while I can. Oh boy. This might be a bad move that I did. Where's my gun? Oh, I don't think I can use gun. Oh, he's gonna notch that. Nope, it cannot. It, he's good. He's gone. Splash won't like splash. 
One Mirage. Nice. Nice. Oh, what are those tracers coming from? I have no idea where these tracers are coming from. Oh, what are those? Oh. Rifle. Sorry, dude. I'm helping you out. There you go. Pop some flares for him.